who am I to follow Lady Gaga? Uh, listen, I, I want to speak about guaranteeing success in this tournament. Now, do all of the kids have this sheet? If you could pull it out for me right now. This is actually very important. And I'll, I'll tell you that for the parents, it's actually just as important um, for them as well. And this is far more important than what, at this age, all the kids are capable of understanding. So what I'd like to do is plant the seed. I'm not going to speak for a long time. But if you see on this sheet, it says, guaranteeing success at the USDA National Clays. And it goes, your focus and your effort. How can you guarantee success in this tournament if no one, no one can guarantee winning? How do you guarantee success? And if you look at this sheet, you'll see there's two sides. And this is very serious. Two sides. One says things you can control and things you cannot control. Now, somebody tell me, I wrote one thing down there. It goes on the things you can't control. It says the outcome. So I gave you a hint. On the other side, things you can control, let's say your attitude. What are some of the things that you can control that are going to help you perform your best? Is there anybody who has an idea? Yes, right here. Effort. Absolutely. When you watch people at these great tournaments on TV, you watch Wimbledon, effort is huge. What else? Yes. Mindset. That, you can talk for hours on that. Mindset being, and follow this, because I'm going to piggyback on that. I've been blessed to talk to kids right before they go into the finals of a national. I've been blessed to talk with young kids when they're about to go on for the finals of an ITF. I've been blessed to speak with people right before they were going on for the finals of a junior, a junior Grand Slam, multiple, a lot of them. I've been blessed to look somebody in the eyes right before they're going out to the finals of their first pro tournament. I've been blessed to be able to work with people when that person, multiple, are looking me in the eye and they have a life-changing match in front of them worth tens of millions of dollars, amazing fame for a lifetime, and they're looking right at me for guidance. And two minutes from now, they're going out onto the center court. And you know what you tell them? Do you know what you try to get across to them? You can't guarantee the outcome. But guarantee when you go out and you come off that court that you have done the things that we are talking about here. Every effort you can give, one point at a time. And listen to this. Whenever, whenever you start thinking about the result and winning and the fame or anything like that, walk around and flush that thought away and get back to all of the things you control. When you focus on that, your attitude, your effort, staying in the moment, being positive, being your own best friend, playing your game to the best of your ability, when you do that, you are now giving yourself the best chance to win. Your Number one goal, this will sound really funny to you, and you'll say, wait a second, that can't be right. The number one goal when you go to compete, any great champion in any field knows this. It cannot be to be focused on the result. The moment you're focused on the result, you are no longer focused on 
you executing to the best of your ability. The challenge when you're talking to that person right before they go out on the court at Wimbledon or the US Open or for an Olympics finals, you know, for a gold medal match, the challenge is to get them to let go of focusing on the outcome and focusing only on the things they can control, which we talked about a little bit here, but you can sit down with your parents and go over with them and you'll find, oh, these are a list of things I can't control. These are a list of things I can control. And if you do that, then when you walk off the court, you will have given yourself the best chance to win, the best chance to play as well as you can, and the opportunity to improve and grow. This is something every great champion understands in every single sport. And that is why they can free flow and play because it's not about the other person. It's about them and they can control themselves and they are committed to being the best they can be. So if I would just pass on to you, one of the things that comes in there is when you do this, and parents, I left a note there, and I wrote it by hand this morning, and I, I said, you know, I just want to make it by hand. That promotes joy and passion and love for what they're doing. And all the adults know that when you're doing something with a joy and passion, boy, you're going to be pretty darn good at it, just like all of you are off to a great start. I wish you all the best. Enjoy this journey because the journey is your reward. Thank you for your time.